crap out of me. There's a skelly. In the house? Um, no, in the little ruin. I decided since we were, you know, taking stuff. How do we only have four viewers? <laughs> That's just the way things go sometimes. That and I, I only started on streaming on Twitch like uh, beginning of the year, roughly. Maybe like the end of December, something like that. So a lot of these people who have like tons of viewers on Twitch have been doing this for years. Um, so you just kind of have to put in the time and eventually you reach out to enough people and and I tend to play a bunch of various games, so I have some people that are like diehard for me. Like if I were to like load up Empyrean, I'd probably have more people in here um, than just four. <laughs> but uh, it's just it's just how it is. It's just like a roll of dice sometimes. Uh, let's just put like all this random crap in here. bundles put that guy back down all right Shelton we're just gonna put you like you can like act like you're supervising the area there you go watch my stuff make sure no one takes it okay if something happens I'm blaming you <laughs> all right we're <laughs> Definitely looking a little better here. Go ahead and get some more of these. Uh, craft it out. Okay. Last stream, you had like 20 viewers. Also, my friend has been on Twitch for only months and he gets hundreds of viewers. That's maybe because he plays Fortnite, though. Fortnite is very popular right now, but I just can't. I can't do Fortnite. Not for. Ugh. I just can't get into Fortnite. I did do Apex Legends like once or twice, but it's just. It's not something I can just sit down and play for hours. I like games where I can just sit down and play for hours. This is one of these things right here. Like Portal Knights, you can just kind of chill and enjoy it. And you can go for... You can probably play this damn game all day if you wanted to. I can't do that with Fortnite. You just... I don't know, it just feels repetitive. It's a good word for it. All right, let's roll back here and check out this and get some more of the benches and stuff out of there. Hey, back to Squire's Knoll. I'm going to find out about my landing pad if I can take it. I'm going to have to take all these seeds too for my future garden. It's kind of hard to find entertaining streamers that play games like Portal Knights and Terraria. Uh... I can understand that. I'm glad you're being entertained, though. I aim to please! <laughs> yeah, since you like Terraria, you're gonna have to uh, check out Terraria Thursdays. And for that matter, if you want to join us for Terraria Thursdays, although you're on PS4. Do you have Terraria on PC? Oh, cool, that's not baby wheat. Yeah!
Why can't I get those? Look here, lady. Surrender the wheat. There we go. Momo, are you underground? Yes. Are you in that tower stealing stuff? Nothing important. You're like, oh, this world's gonna get regenerated. <laughs> Steal everything. If it's not bolted down, it's Momo's. <laughs> See, and now I can have a big proper farm with like all this stuff sectioned out. You know, like a, a tree area, a berry area. It's gonna be glorious. This just felt like kind of small in here. And I had to keep spending time getting dirt and terraforming. Away. How do you what? Stop telling on you? I said, how did I give myself away? Because your, your icon is showing you under the ground to me. And I'm like, what the hell are you doing down there? The good news is, if you want to break the patio for any reason, we have enough brick. Cool. Look here, green slime, get off my lawn! <laughs> I went on my fence back. I worked hard to make this fence. I'm taking it back! That's right, Janine. I'm taking your fence, too. Guys are being evicted. You didn't pay your rent. Came in here and improved your house. And you couldn't pay your new bill. Sorry. It's just business. It's not personal. need for a protector <laughs> how far in terraria am i on terraria thursday right now it's pre-hard mode um we died to skeletron uh the last time so that's where we're at we're still trying to explore and get life crystals for everybody so that we can eventually defeat skeletron so that's where we're at right now look here dude you can definitely get the hell off my lawn. Damn, Frost. Who invited you? No one invited you! Get out of my cotton. My cotton. Hey, I'll take protection. You know? Especially if I don't have to pay for it. You know, like the Mafia. <laughs> you have full health and have defeated Skeletron. Nice. So yeah, that's the Terraria Thursday. We, we came in with all brand new characters, brand new world, expert mode, and uh, we're doing it from scratch. Excuse me. And then uh, prior to that, we got the global world, which is uh, you can bring in any character you want. And we went through and killed Moon Lord. My first time killing Moon Lord. And, and uh, even though summoners are kind of weak early game, let me tell you, summoners at the end, like, Bring it on. I feel like I'm totally uh, invulnerable with my summoner now. He's just, he's amazing balls. Totally worth it. Look how much cotton I've gotten so far. 177. <laughs> expert mode. Yeah, expert mode is, um, the cool thing about expert mode is in multiplayer, everyone gets a loot bag when you kill the boss, but it's a lot harder. Momo reminds you of Avatar The Last Airbender. What? Why is that disabled? Why? Why do you say that? What's the, what's the link there? Is it the voice? One of the characters is called Momo. 
Oh, you know, it's been so long since I watched that. I think before I even knew you. All right, we definitely have tons of seeds for sure now. Who is that? What's up? Hey. Not much. How you guys doing? Doing right. Playing Portal Knights. I have it downloaded and installed. I was just gonna Hell make sure it was okay for me to come play with you guys. Yeah, go for it. You should just right click and join, and it'll show you as joining. Uh, Momo's playing the Ranger. I'm the Mage guy. So the Warrior is the only class we don't have. Although I don't really think it's that important. You can play whatever you want. I'm just gonna say like. If I get a chance to be a mage in Minecraft, you know that was like one of my goals for the longest time. That's true. Just gotta unlock this last character real quick and then I'll hop on over. So for those that are watching on Twitch, that is J-Bodge. He is all about murder, loot, and doing cool shit. <laughs> Tangled. My problem is that I got in the hard mode and now I'm scared to play because I'm afraid that I'll screw up and the corruption will spread throughout my whole world. You don't have to worry that much about it, Tackle, because you can always buy the solutions, I think from the uh, the steampunker, and you can use the contaminator to cleanse the world. I'm actually in the process on our global one of chunking it all up in the grids, so that way when I go through in a cleansing area, it won't get contaminated again. So, where are you at right now? Uh, the first world, I just harvested back up my garden. There's different worlds and shit? Yeah, you yep. portal night, so you have to find portals to jump to like a new world. Well, you know, context clues have never been my, my, my thing. Installed. Okay. Remember how I said it was installed? I never hit the install button. It'll be a oh, few no. seconds. It doesn't take long. No, it's a little game. You too. I think I was playing a game, watching YouTube and Twitch all at the same time, and it's still downloaded in like under 30 minutes. Yeah. Yeah, it's not a super intense game. Though. It looks kind of neat, though. I'm so excited. Why? Because it's been forever since I've played a game with like many of you guys. Oh. We're not. Have you been doing ESO with bloops or you guys aren't really talking that much? Um, I don't even know where he plays or what he plays. He plays ESO now. He's been doing some Does ESO. He? Yeah. Oh, because um I never see him like online or in the game. Huh. Unless I don't have that information on Steam. I'm pretty sure that I added Bloops on my Steam thing. I also never see him online. He must have uh, banned us. Hidden. Or blocked, blocked us? Hidden himself? I don't know. Yep. Maybe. Haters. I wonder if I could pick up my landing pad again. Alrighty. Okay, it's installing. I'm going to grab a glass of water. I'll be right back. Is there anything in here I want to get rid of? At the moment, I think we need to collect more fences. Did I leave fences behind? Doesn't look like it. Well, they had a house. <laughs> it's totally gone now. Let's see if we can. Oh, all this cotton. All right, you know, let's just go. We'll come back here and see if we can get the landing pad in a moment. That's your problem. To get to Steampunk, you need to defeat a mechanical boss. With my skill, the corruption would have spread by the time I defeat one. Also, to get the gun that fires solution, you need to spend three platinum coins, which I don't have, which is because I can't kill hard mode enemies because my weapons are weak. 
Oh, I can't reclaim a landing pad. Damn it. Tacko, do you just hang out with me? I'll show you the ways. If you've already killed Skeletrime, you have access to make unlimited platinum. You just need to get yourself crab or bird statue and um, um, jellyfish statue is the most uh, lucrative. You wire up a button to launch the bird statue or crab statue over pressure plates. And as they step on the pressure plates or fly over them, it'll generate, uh, think of like an electric impulse. It triggers and wire that all up to a statue, the jellyfish statue. And then a, like a dart trap. And then as the jellyfish spawn from the statue, they get shot by the dart traps and then they drop their goodies. And then you sell the, uh, the necklace that they drop and you can sit there and do this AFK. So you just step, you just stop in and check your computer every once in a while or your PS4, whatever you're playing on. And then you just sell all that to a merchant and Bob's your uncle. Wait, did I just put a whole bunch of wheat in there? I could probably turn that all into straw. Just give me a heads up, you reset. Oh, I'm gonna make sure everybody knows. Okay. There's still, um... Oh, I can't get the landing pad back, so I think that area is pretty much Either done for. Them? Yeah, you can't, you can't pick them back up, oh. but it's okay. That's way too complicated. <laughs> You just need the 32. Does it give you back resources, or does it just hang out there? I don't think you can pick it up at all. You could try banging on it with your pickaxe and see what it does. It might not give you back the ingredients. Yeah, give it a whirl. And if you if you um if you want, when I get done doing portal nights, or maybe um, I know I can always boot up Terraria and show you. But since I'm kind of hosting at the moment, <laughs> it wouldn't be a good idea to do it at, the, at this time. But I can show you. I don't mind giving you like a tour of the Terraria world. All right, let's see. We want to make all the cotton. Probably gonna be like zillions of cotton. Click, 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 click. Hey, two workbenches means I can do two jobs simultaneously. This is why Disabled Gamer in his cool build he had two of everything. See? See? It's probably a good idea. Oh, snap. It sounds like it already got done over there. Where the hell is the option? Oh, here it is. Straw block. Oh god, the facial hair in this game is fantastic. <laughs> yeah, dude, my character has a beard because I can't grow one IRL. <laughs> I like it. Oh, it only lets you queue up the 50 at a time? That's BS. It should let you queue up however many you want to make. As long as you can make them. Call shenanigans. I still have plenty of uh, cotton for this thing to use. Gracious. All right, we might as well find our seed box here. I think it was the one furthest away. Yeah. Planes of Passage is the only build where I have two of everything. Oh, that was. I watched more than a few of your videos. And I also bookmarked your channel. So I can always check that out. All right, we picked up two more of these. Not gonna have any problem seeing in this place at nighttime. 
What else do we have that we still need to sort through? Seeds still. Amber. Some wheat seeds. I can work on the garden here eventually. There's my fences. Alright, here we go. Another... <laughs> We're getting an achievement called Mass Production on Steam right now. All right, we must. Wow, it like jumped at me. Crazy, crazy benches. All right, so yeah, this one's making some straw blocks. Oh, good, we're out of cotton finally. Cotton, finished product up there and here. Look at that. Made uh, 120 bolts of cotton cloth, I guess. I guess these are bolts. Okay. I guess behind the portal, I could put my garden in. Or maybe I'll wait to see where Momo starts building the big grand mansion. I was thinking like forward of the makeshift uh, area we got. Okay. That way you don't have to run too far to, to get supplies. And we can just build from the staging area forward. Labaj has joined. Hello. Hello. Welcome back, Tech Gold. I'm gonna get pwned. There's, there's, no there's monsters. the monsters here. <laughs> what? How do I sprint? Uh, you are you automatically run. Shift makes you dodge, but you can kind of spam that to go a little quicker. Oh my god, it's like Zelda. Am I allowed to just to break? Stuff here. Oh, I just swear. I always forget. Yes, you can swear, and yes, you can break stuff. Alright. Disable says he can't wait to finish his mansion, Sword mostly because it's your last build. Um, go back to... Go to the island called Squire's Knoll, and go murder stuff there. You can get some sweet XP. I'm assuming I stand on? No. Um, just hit M. You can just warp from the map menu. It's north of here. The squires know. That's it. Bye. So wait, are you a mage or are you a warrior? Because that looked like I'm a sword. A you made a warrior? Okay. okay. I didn't know if there was like competition for loot. They also nah. said there were giant axes that I could have, and I kind of wanted giant Whoa. Axes. Okay. Starburst jelly beans are amazing, guys. You haven't had Starburst jelly beans? You need to get some. <laughs> Alright. I should probably keep trying to sort my stuff. Don't know how much wood Momo's going to need, but I can always let her make that. All right, cool. You better have Cadbury eggs. Oh, those are, those are good too. And it is the time for Cadbury eggs. All right, what do we want to plant here? Cotton seeds. Bird. I gotta fight that. The parrot thing? Yeah, the emerald parrot. Yeah. 
Cotton seed, cotton seed, amber, wheat seeds, spring tree seeds. Yeah, I think that's all stuff I can plant. Wait, is that you or is that, is that a hostile? Everyone's tagged with a name. So if there's no Momo or, or Exum over it, that's a bad guy or it could be a person, like an NPC. About the Terraria thing, it would take long to farm up that much. Oh, the corruption was spread by them. Also, that doesn't solve the problem about me defeating a mechanical boss. And again, I have thought about getting a mushroom spear for the oh, destroyer. Wow. Wow. Your birthday is Tuesday, disabled gamer? My birthday is tomorrow. Check it out. I'm going to give you guys a sneak peek. So I did my overlay for Portal Knights today. See how it's all here at the top? for my, my um, goals and things. And it's out of the way of the UI and the game, so it's perfect. But then I also went ahead, because I'm probably going to be playing this tomorrow on my birthday, and just for anyone who stops in, they'll be able to see that it's my birthday, because I've got uh, bottom left hand corner of the screen right now. See, it says happy birthday. <laughs> la di da Happy birthday! And then, uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep that on there or not. I'm also toying around with the idea of uh, of this, like a happy birthday frame, but you can't really see the happy birthday in it. So I might just go with the one in the bottom left hand corner. <laughs> but yeah, that's tomorrow. And I'm probably gonna do like a marathon stream or something. Just like sit here and do like a marathon of portal nights. It's gonna be glorious. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So yeah, we'll celebrate my birthday on Monday, and then Disabled Gamer celebrate your birthday on Tuesday. <laughs> it's gonna be great fun. All right, let's see here. Garden, that's what I'm working on. All right, we need to hoe it up. And I should have more than four fences, so. Fences got put somewhere. I'm gonna be 36 years old. Okay. That's not too shabby. Bodge, I think when you get to level 3, you can um, upgrade your gear. Excellent. Is he behaving? You'll be 35. Oh, that's right, because you got the 84 in your name. So I already figured out you were close to be my age, because I'm 83. Look at this. It's like the moon door. Game of Thrones style. Just like bitch slap someone right down into the moon door. <laughs> All right, let's get a hoe out. Uh, let's see. I guess we'll start off with like a traditional dirt path going here. Just do something too wide. Something kind of cool. Works with the landing pad anyway. And we can put like cotton on one side, wheat on the other, get some of those berries in here so we can make some healing potions for those that might want some healing potions. Yeah, I think I'll hoe all the way to the end here, why not? That's a great place for a fence. Like, watch yourself. See the edge of the world. Although you can go right up on top of the fence and launch yourself into your doom. <laughs> Whatever, man. It's a fence that doesn't do a good job of being a fence. It's just really there for looks. All right. 
because I really like this whole hoed look here. We're just gonna keep doing this to the this right here. So I'm sure maybe someone might want to put some stone in here, but this is a really quick way of making a path. Yeah, cool. All right, uh, I guess we'll just start planting stuff. Hmm. Yeah, one roll away. Sure, why not? Are there quests that reward more experience than just killing people? Yes, but we kind of um, did those. You can oh. try talking to the people and see if they um, give you the option. I don't know if they will or not, but try it. You can get orange stone blocks for the pass. That, that'll be cool. Oh, did I actually just recruit someone? I clicked come along. I don't know what it does. Okay. Oh, it puts them in your inventory. You can pop them back out. That's terrifying. Well, it's great if they're a merchant because you can move all the merchants into the base. We're going to make like a villager area for them. I like this hoe. This works pretty quick. I might have to close in the moon door area here. I have dirt blocks somewhere. Corn. Yay. Have I heard about Article 13? Are we just talking about like the the military Article 13? Like when your ass is getting kicked out? Class is in session. All right, here we go. I'm ready to learn. I see you, Momo. If you don't like it being nighttime, you can always go sleep in the bed, and you'll advance the world here by six hours. So you may have to sleep twice. Oh, okay. But that's an option. Yeah. I was just trying to figure out, um... Now what? Now you get to build! Well, let me find a place to put all this furniture in my pockets. On the ground, like you've been doing? <laughs> I've got like... 30, 30 slots of furniture I need to place. Oh, did you go stealing stuff again? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the European Parliament passed a new copyright law. I don't need to repair that.
almost level two. You can do this, Jay Punch. I believe in you. <laughs> That's a short lesson. <laughs> it's probably still typing stuff. It's still pretty funny. All right, we're gonna put a bunch of cotton down. Uh, see, that's already 10. One of the articles, Article 13, says that European YouTubers are restricted more than ever. No gaming videos, music covers, etc. Interesting. I wonder if that's just like a blanket policy or if... Um... The terms of service of a game developer actually would still overwrite that because that would make the most sense to me since they're the one they're the intellectual property holders because <clears throat> before i stream oh, a game i go and make sure that i can stream it without breaking any uh copyright laws Last thing I need is to go to court. All right, that's wheat. Oh, that's cotton. That's also cotton. Huh. Something to look into, though. I just had a uh, course for um, my business degree, uh, business law. And we got to go through all kinds of stuff. Torts, intellectual property. Yeah, so copyright infringement stuff. Very fascinating topics. All right, now we got wheat seeds. We're gonna plant some wheat. I really think I don't need much more than that for cotton. I think I might just fill in that last row so it has some symmetry. All right, and then... Uh... Is there a level cap in this game? Good question. The talents go up to 30. See, what right, I'm gonna need move speed boots before anything else. This is infuriatingly slow. Ah. Uh, Are there move speed boots? I don't know. Oh, God. Speed oh, God. potions. Yeah, they're swiftness potions. They only last for a few seconds, but I'm assuming that there's ways to move faster because of that. Level cap is thirty. Nice. Has been confirmed on Twitch. Thanks to Disabled Gamer chiming in. Oh. He's our resident mobile Wikipedia. Well, thank you, resident gamer. Disabled Gamer. <laughs> Am I allowed to call him that? Is that actually his name? That's his name! Oh, okay. If you increase your agility, you can go faster. Oh, okay. Oh, that's okay. from a newcomer to the to the channel. What's up, Kershank? Or sorry, Kershak Elfbane. Welcome. I have five rangers at level thirty. You must really like rangers. <laughs> Oh yeah, I know you're a ranger because you had a wicked like fiery bow. It looked really cool. Ooh, axes, hammers, or swords. You can change that on the fly, so don't think you're stuck. Oh, thank God. 
Because the axes seem like a pretty cool deal right now. Oh yeah, getting more viewers is always a positive. Damn it. Ah, Damn it. an opportunity on that one. I don't think I wanted to chop that block. Okay, whatever. We are gardening in our new area. I bought this deed and it gave me access to this area. The vacant... What is this again? This is kind of like killing grassland forest, area. Though, forest. Yeah. Oh, wait. Can I roll through there and kill myself? Yes, I can. That's terrifying. You can fall through the world, too. All right, moving right along here. Soon we're gonna plant the wheat, and then we're gonna set up a tree area somewhere. So that's where it's gonna be, huh? That's the start. Big double doors. I think so. Oh yeah, I'm I'm excited. Oh, this is a building game too, so we gotta have epic housing, don't we? <laughs> that's what we're working on. We destroyed our starter house that we took over from this old couple, and now we've moved into this property that I bought. I got the deed to oh. this area. You mean this house where these two old people are just standing outside in the elements? Yep. Wow! As someone who kind of likes old people, that's tough. They yeah, couldn't pay their yeah, bill. They'll have a home again. They could- wait, they had a bill? Like, you- I, I'm very confused. Like, are you just being a cheeky sh Oh, no! I mean, come on. We went, Okay, so here's how it worked in the story, alright? You show up there, and dude is too lazy to fix his own house. So the lady is like, I wish my dear husband would get off his ass and fix the house. But then he just gives you a quest to fix up the house for him. So then you bust your ass fixing up his house, and it's in shambles. So not only did we fix his house, but then we extended it and made it much bigger. Then he couldn't pay the bill. And this is just me being facetious at this point. It's not really a game mechanic. So, I mean, crackheads know how to pay the crack bill. If you want to smoke crack, you pay your dealer and you get some crack. But if you can't pay for your house, you don't get a house anymore. So I took their house away from them. I, I don't... Okay. <laughs> okay. <sighs> oh, disabled. I did give yeah, Momo the link on this one, earlier today. Have access to right now. I told her that you shared it with me, so she has the link. All right, we got a couple more weed seeds right here. And okay, cool. I think we're down to just uh, Alabaster. blast. That's the bushes, spring trees, emerald trees. Okay. So I'm assuming that different planets have different leveled monsters and they give different varying amounts of XP. That's right. Okay. So if you want to go to the second world, oh, and by the way, second world, get all the copper you find, bruh. In the dusty junction? In the Magic desert. Maggots? Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Oh, wow. watch out for those maggots, man. They are danger noodles. <laughs> They pop up from the ground. What? <laughs> yeah, they they pop up out of the ground and then start shooting shit at you. Danger noodles. <laughs> Bob just gonna be like, what the fuck? Great fun. Great fun. <clears throat> All right, what do you know? ethereal blue spirit. Kill it. Those are the nighttime Hollow Knight guys that you can murder. They oh, give better XP, been... too. He's a spectral knight. You were wrong. Two great beasts stand between you and your... Oh, I gotta go fight something called a great beast? Fuck yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Oh, 
I don't know how much wood we're going to be using in the house, but I probably should get a nice, sizable tree farm going. Danger noodles! Lots of wood, huh? Okay. This might be a dumb question. Is there a button to switch to first person? Middle mouse. You push it in. Thank you. No prize, Bob. All right, we can finish more cotton for sure. Emerald trees. I'm trying to find stone in the desert, and I'm thinking that I might have a better time not doing dark that. Fur, dark fur, so much dark fur. Correct. There isn't really any. Wheat there. seeds. Spring trees. Here we go. Oh, no. oh, Bushes. What? <laughs> what? Garden mushrooms. Can't do anything with pumpkins, I don't think, here. That's the fairy area. Dark fur. Sandy palms. Look at all this cotton. Some red rocks and shit. All right, good. We made a nice dent in the seed box. <clears throat> all right, let's finish the cotton. Just occurred to me I might need to reevaluate this. Oh, I think I was going to... No, we're just going to make all this cotton. Hell with it. Cotton on one side. Weed on the other. Segmented plots. Oh, you get experience for mining things. I like this. Me too. I like that as well. Nope, oh, we're okay. I don't think we're ever going to need this much cotton. <laughs> it's like a freaking damn cotton field. Oh shit, there's another 50. What? Well, you know, they say go big or go home. So that's what we're doing. We can use it for rugs. Oh, that's true. There's the bushes. Garden mushrooms. Trees. All right, spring tree. Spring tree. All right, let's go figure out. Oh, do. that's a turtle person. Angry turtle oh, man. Angry oh. turtle man. Get ready to use your dodge button. <laughs> you mean my run away like a little girl button? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> the things fully break. Um, the goes red when you keep using it until the durability is gone and it takes forever to use and I think the damage greatly decreases yeah but, no, but you can repair does not disappear awesome. screw you turtle guy two pieces of stone bodge and then you can do your crafting and you can make oh, a sharpening yeah. okay yeah no there's no stone on this planet All right, we got bushes. I'm gonna find wood, but I'm gonna fight this orc. Oh. Bushes. Oh, look at that, my cotton's already growing. Sweet. All right, let's see.
not so dangerous if you only have to fight one at a time. True. Put the bushes over here. I don't know how to make the the stone uh, bricks. I wanted to know how to do that. Might be like when we get workbench upgrade number three or something along those lines. Right. Would you be sad if I took a large amount of cloth and berries? No, go for it. We have tons of cotton and I'm going to be making berry bushes. About to plant that okay. now. Not a whole lot. Sounds like Momo's going to be making a bunch of carpet for a new place. Yes, Disabled Gamer, the uh, stone brick blocks. We can mine up stone. Stone and dirt forge level one. Oh. Kershak Elfbane says that you can put stone and dirt forge level one makes bricks. Stone and dirt forge. Yeah, stone and dirt at the forge. Oh, 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 okay, hold on. I don't know if we have a forge. We have a furnace. Maybe that's what he means. Thanks very much for the tips, guys. Keep them coming. Yeah, he confirmed his furnace. Okay. I'm so assuming... If we can up the You're a dude, Kershak. Elfbane Ooh, could no, be a that girl. Takes basalt. I don't like how they regain health. That's dumb. Oh, the mobs? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Stone brick, dirt block. Oh, we can make rune stone. Oh, darn. Ooh, we can make real roofs now. Oh, that's a lot of coal. Never mind. Unless we have coal bushes, we're not doing that. <laughs> How much, um, you got stone on you right now, right? Can you drop me a few pieces? Yeah, one second. Thanks. Did that drop? Okay. Yeah. Um, this table. All right, I'm going to drop the stone back to you. Okay. This is the grassland. But there's some trees here. See? Vacant grassland island. Oh, that's cute. I guess while I'm going back there, I might as well go ahead and extend the strip.
Yeah, I figured I would just stick with the grassland because I was going to be planting trees anyway. And so it'd be less to chop down. <laughs> that was the thought process anyway. I, I know this is how it goes, man. When you start doing a build. I mean, this is, this is the thought process behind this. I will not have any want for cloth or berries or um, any straw or wheat. And when Momo gets done with the house, we will have a really, really cool looking house, man, with storage. So I won't have to worry about where I'm going to put my crap. It's all going to be nice and organized. It's going to be glorious. So then when I do my exploration across the world, Ooh, it's going to be great. I make a top look great Ooh. Ooh. Better record. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Jay what what does it take? It takes me being level six. Murder more stuff. Yes, but I found a copper axe that does not take me being level six. There you go. Is that like level three? Yeah, let's go look at some stuff. We gotta figure out how to make things. You know, gotta, gotta learn a whole new system. Yeah, the uh, the warrior makes equipment at the um, anvil. Yes. There we go. All right, let's plant our bushes. How does one make cotton cloth? We have a shit ton of that. Just go to a chest. But to make it, you go and uh, punch down a cotton bush, and you get cotton, and then you turn cotton into cloth. Okay. Do we have any bones? We have like six or seven bones, but yes. Permission to make myself armor with some of said bones? If I promise. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, your equipment stuff, go for it. Coal, basalt, obsidian, marble, and celestial blocks are all raw materials and cannot be crafted, only collected. That was from Disabled Gamer. Tank Gold says, normally I spend more time on exploring. Oh, don't worry, we're going to be getting the exploring on. And it's got to have a home base. It's very important you have a home base. At least I think it's very important to have a home base. <laughs> Alright, so. Let's get back in here. That was all the berries? That was all the berries. Wow. All right. I feel like I'm learning. I'm proud of you, Bodge. Is there like a sorting convention we're following? Uh, right now, it's just kind of like open season on the chest. You can stack stuff, though. There's a little um, icon in the middle. And you can click it and you can say deposit stacks. So if you do that on all the chests, at least you'll have stuff sort where there's already matching items. That's ah, why you have unlocked 21 I uh, islands. Okay, yeah. If you focus on exploring, that's what is going to happen. All right. Next up, we're going to have to make a tree farm. Oh, wait. We have these mushroom seeds. Maybe I should just split this patch. I think for right now, we're going to split the patch. I really don't okay. know okay. what okay. I'm going to be using all these mushrooms for. So let's just... Uh, Flip this. Hmm. All right, and then it's going to be tree time. 